Hey everybody, this is Mr. Hardcore Mode, where nothing's easy. We are back with another hard rant coming to you for Concord it is now officially shut down. Yes, that's right. Concord, the game that they sh they thought that was going to pop rocks and, and just hit the shelves. They literally thought that thing was going to come out and be gangbusters. They did. They thought that game was going to be game busters. And I regret to inform them, it flopped. Um, the characters, their abilities were samey. Um, none of their characters really popped out to anybody. Um, nobody really wants a... Well, actually, no, I'm going to I'm gonna say this wrong. People do want hero shooters, just not this one. Because Marvel Rivals is coming out and it's actually doing better numbers. There's also another one called Deadlock. And it's actually looking better than this one and it's got some diverse characters too the only difference is the characters in concord are literally the reason why people were turned off it's barely the 40 dollars that turned people off from concord people are saying ah concord was the reason that people didn't want to play uh, i mean uh, well the 40 dollars is the reason people didn't want to play concord no it's not uh, they listen do not underestimate gooners okay they have spent 30 50 hundred dollars three hundred dollars on gooning over gotcha girls they spent their money on first descendant they spent their money on genshin impact they will goon if you give them the the good shit i don't see anything on rule 34 because nobody wants that shit that's the that's the bottom line who's the primary audience men what do men like to see i'm gonna give you one good answer it's good looking characters even women women too women really do here's the thing that they left because now they're officially shut down uh concord fans We've been listening closely to your feedback since the launch of Concord on PS5 and PC. Uh, one thing that I want to say is, every time when they want to talk about feedback, by the time that they listen to feedback, the game is already out. The game is already fleshed out. They already got... <laughs> There's no point to where they, they will bring out the game really, really early and we can start to talk about feedback. By the time that PlayStation or any high-end... Uh, um, like AAA studio comes out and brings out something everything is already done and set you know what I mean the beta comes out they're not going to switch characters they're not going to change anything maybe a couple of abilities here and there but they're not going to change shit anyway um, we want to thank everyone who has joined the journey aboard the North Star your support and the passionate community that has grown around the game has meant the world to us. Okay, man, that's a, a community of uh, 45 people. That's great. However, while many qualities of the experience resonated with players, 45, uh, we also recognize that other aspects of the game and our initial launch didn't land the way we've intended. Therefore, at this time, we have decided to take the game offline beginning September 6th 2024 the end explore options including those that uh will better reach our players concord is dead they're not going to revive this thing uh, people are going to get laid off people uh, see 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 what i mean this is the reality of the shit if you if you give us ugly ass characters with they them pronouns and shit that we don't care about that ideology ideology shit throw that shit out the fucking window give us some beautiful characters profit it's the easiest thing it's the easiest thing but if you want to blow 200 million dollars by all means it ain't my money it's not the audience's money chad do you got 200 million dollars just laying around no okay go ahead um while we determine the best uh, path ahead, Concord sales will cease immediately and we will begin to offer a full refund. That's a smart idea. For all gamers who have purchased the game uh, for PS5 or PC. If you purchase the game for PlayStation 5 from the PlayStation Store or PlayStation Direct, a refund will be issued back to the original payment method. 
Customers who purchased from the digital storefronts will also be refunded. More information about refunds from Steam and Epic can be found below. Steam store. You know what the funny thing is? Is that the game has to flop in order for you to get your money back. This happened for Cyberpunk. This also happened for this game. It's never, it's never like, hey, me, just one individual hates this game. I would like a full refund, please. No, you're not going to get a full refund. You've played the game for three hours. Well, okay. But if the game flops, then you're going to give me a refund? Oh, okay. Oh, you got 200 million on your Minecraft, sir? Ah, nice, nice, Jordan. Hey, share share the load, man. Uh, so this is the place that they can, you know, give the mon uh, money back. If you got Epic Store, Steam Store, other resale refunds, that's basically it. And that is that. Um, that's it. It's gone. It's dead. Let me show you why they died. Here we go. This is the game. This is, this is, this is what they showed to us. This is what they showed us. We thought this was fucking a new game that was like, well, it is a new game. We thought it was a game that was kind of like Guardians of the Galaxy. We thought it was going to be like a one player, uh, one player game that could be kind of interesting. A ragtag, a group of heroes trying to get paid up in the stars or something. We thought it was going to be tailored to something along the lines of funny jokes going around, you know, shooting the shit, that sort of thing. Some of the characters kind of look okay some of the characters look like shit but i also thought it was going to be a movie it gave off this star wars sort of vibe it gave off this sort of like oh man i wonder what the hell's going on i saw these three characters and i was like okay that's fine these characters look all right and as the thing was going through i i, I this whole robot came out this badass looking dude came out. He looks kind of badass. So I'm not going to lie. Um, they, they tried to be funny. It wasn't fucking funny. Um, and then as it went through, I was like, okay, this could be a cool movie. And then I saw all these characters and I was like, Jesus Christ. It's, it's, it's fucking uh, good. Good Lord. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I was working on. And I thought to myself, this could be a really good, like, little side movie. This could be, like, a really cool, like, one-player game where you play as different characters. Then I saw him shoot the fucking sauce, and I was like, what the hell is this? And then as this was going, I was just like, okay, well, then what the hell is going to go on? And then as, as things went on, I was thinking to myself, please don't be a multiplayer. Please don't be a multiplayer. He was doing different abilities, that sort of thing. And I was just like, you're going to be a multiplayer, aren't you? And then as the th thing was going on, I thought, yo, okay, some of them have cool powers. The cinematics always look nice. This area looked really amazing. I thought we could get some deep lore. He, even when the game came out, I, there was no bit of lore that was interesting. There, there was nothing out there. It, it was just a whole bunch of heroes and then they were together. I, I, there, there was no bit of lore that was seen here. Um, lady had a shield, and I was thinking to myself, this is going to be a hero shooter. When he used that fucking suction thing, I was like, yeah, this is going to be a hero shooter. And then out of nowhere, as soon as this, like, finished, like, ended with this, save the dude, and ended with this. We were all still confused at what kind of game this was. Looking at this ragtag a bit of group, and I was thinking to myself, okay, well, please, enough with the fucking hot sauce. You're not funny. Um, We finally figured out it was a hero shooter. And we were like, 
we didn't know what the hell was going on in the in in this trailer it, it it gave us no sense of like whatever the game was we had no clue until somebody said at the end i think there were some words at the end where they were like yeah it's gonna be a hero shooter and we we're like what the fuck man it could have been anything else it could have looked like anything yeah that did look like yandu it did it could have looked like anything else well here's also here's overwatch's cinematic playthrough cinematic trailer i'm going to show you overwatch's cinematic trailer and i'm going to show you four or five things the reason why people were hyped about the game and look 17 million views concord 346 views way too many dislikes way too many dislikes but overwatch is looking pretty healthy i wonder why Four or five things. Watch. Soldiers. So awesome design of the characters. Beautiful. It's like it has it brings out the color. It gives you that hero vibe. And you're like, oh, I wonder who this guy is. Oh, I wonder who this ninja guy is. Yo, who's who's this guy behind Lucio? Oh man, that's crazy. And all these different things. And you're thinking to yourself, man, with the music, give that, listen to this hero music. Scientists, adventurers, oddities, guardians who secured Hear global that? peace for a generation. Beautiful. Under its stead. Beautiful look. The vibrant colors, the feeling of heroism. Awesome. Definitely a hero shooter. And then it pans out to a CGI. Blizzard Entertainment. So it gives you that Disney Pixar uh, vibe with these two kids. Um, that is the art. The kids like gives it that Disney look. That's number two. The level is the the Doom Fist. Now you got a little bit of lore with you. Now you want to find out who the heck has that Doom Fist. Oh shit! It's Doom Fist. Okay, now you got a little bit of lore. That's three right there. That's two. It was like, bro. <laughs> little goofy. Little goofy moments like that. That's the reason right there. That's the reason right there. That reason right there that you see right there, that's another reason to bring players in. Hot purple chicks out of fucking nowhere using sniper rifles. And she speaks French. Hello? Now everybody's sitting up. They're watching and they're just like, oh man, this game looks good. See a hot purple bitch and they're like, oh shit, oh fuck, well, what are we doing now? <laughs> and then, I'm gonna turn off the music. Okay, giant gorilla, some people might like that. But let, let, let's be honest, we see an edgy looking, like fucking guy with a reaper cloak. So that get, gets in touch with the edge lords out there. Everybody looks at this character. And they're, they're just like, yo, who's this character, right? Who Who's this mysterious black, like demon sort of character? So you're kind of like, it's kind of interested. And then lo and behold, fucking tracer comes out of fucking nowhere and now that's two hot chicks and now you're now the crowd is just like what the fuck what the fuck i i i, I now the crowd is live uh, the 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 men are gooning the girls are gooning everybody's gooning now everybody's gooning girls automatically making cosplay costumes out of these Okay, cool, like, cool fight scenes right here. Watch this. Watch this. Watch how my, watch how Widowmaker just walks like this. It, watch this. Look, 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 at, look at that strut. Look at that strut that she doing. I, I was paying attention. I was paying. A gorilla getting his ass whooped. Using team combos and shit. It's crazy. The, 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 the cop. The, the combat is clean in this CGI. It's clean as hell. What the combat in Concord? What all I remember in that whole fight was 
hot sauce. All I remember was hot sauce. I don't remember what fight was happening. I know what's happening here. And then this dude opens up his ultimate. Oh, oh, got a little, got a little. Everybody laughed at this part right here where the guard wasn't paying attention and he was playing Hearthstone. Everybody laughed because they were just having fun. Yeah, that's like, like four or five reasons right there. And then she says, cheers, love, the cavalry's here. And the kid just goes, <laughs> she said the thing. See what I mean? See what I mean? Beautiful characters. Let's see what kind of characters Concord has. Uh, oh, what? Well, what, what this? What this, dad? Ain't nobody want to play this shit. The fuck is this? Yo. Send her to an insane asylum. Send her to the mines. Who the hell is this? Who said, yeah, this is perfect? What the blue ass make makeup out of fucking nowhere? What the hell is this? She ain't no fucking soldier. She, she looks like she's about to steal my plate. She's going to steal my plate. I don't want her to steal my plate. It's my plate. It's my food. Here's one character that drives me more fucking insane than all the other Concord characters. I, this is trash. But this one right here? This one is an insult to my very fucking eyes. Who, who thought this was going to fly? Who thought this? This is, this looks like if... if this looks like if the dev, Dead Space devs decided to go full woke and this is your main character. This is this is what they would have done. If Dead Space wa was, was woke, this is the character that you would play. I'm looking at this character and I'm like, whoever designed this should should be fired. This is not a joke here. This is I, I'm you wanna make this kind of art? Find your own time. This is this ain't gonna be dollar dollar bills, y'all, over here, okay? This ain't gonna work. I I look at it every day and I'm like, who the hell thought this was a good idea? Which one do you want? Do you want this? Or do you want fucking... Pick a good one. Do you want this? Which one do you want? I like this one. She hot, she cute. Is she gay? I don't remember, but rule 34 taught me something different. That this is, looks terrible. And everybody keeps on saying, it's not because of the character designs. It is. You do not understand the power of gooning. You do not understand your player base. You need to stop getting in your own head and thinking, oh, it's not because, oh man, I'm just a gamer. I don't really goon. Uh, I don't really goon myself. Well, in order for you to understand players, you need to embrace the goon. Join us. Join us. Because we are the players. We are the gamers. And we provide for these developers. We are king. The customer is always king, and we know better. But if I remember correctly, Concord devs kind of insulted their own gamers. So if they fall, well, fuck them. That's all I got for you today. Fuck them. Get them out of here. Get them out of here. Maybe, maybe, maybe not everybody is good at being a game developer. Huh? Maybe, maybe some people just suck at their job. Not, not this whole like, oh man, you don't understand my eye style. No, some people just suck at their job. They shouldn't be game developers. We're going to play some video games. I'm done with these people. Move them. Get them out of here. Get them out of here.